Now, whatever we did right now, the vacancy and the interstitial defects, they are they are valid for a non-ionic solid. Okay, so we did vacancy interstitial interstitial they hold good for non-ionic they hold good for non-ionic solids <coughs> now we'll study frankel and short key they hold for ionic solids okay so so we did we did this we did this the third one is the third one is the frankel defect frankel defect the third is <coughs> the frankel defect Now what happens here one of the ions okay here one of the ions gets dislocated from the original position dislocated from the original position and resides and resides at at the at an interstitial point at an interstitial point so what happens so it creates a vacancy defect at its original position and an interstitial defect at the new position it just migrates from 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 its original point lattice point from its original side to an interstitial site, right? So, so thereby creating a vacancy defect at its original position. and an interstitial defect tissue defect at the new position at the new position right <coughs> 